let's get right into it. Number 10. The Blood Shooting Lizard There's a tiny lizard out there that shoots blood from its eyes when it's scared. Not just a few drops. We're talking streams of blood that can shoot up to 5 feet, like a tiny dragon, but with blood instead of fire. When a predator shows up, they first try to blend in with their spiky armor. If that doesn't work, they puff up like a balloon to look bigger. If that still doesn't work, they bring out the big guns. They squeeze special blood vessels near their eyes until the pressure builds up. Then blood starts squirting out like a water gun filled with hot sauce. The blood isn't just for show. It's loaded with chemicals from all the ants they eat. These chemicals make the blood taste so horrible that even wolves and coyotes run away gagging. They can shoot blood equal to one-third of their total blood supply without dying. That's like a human dumping two liters of blood just to win an argument. Those blood vessels heal right up after the attack, ready to spray the next predator that doesn't get the message. Number 9. The Immortal Jellyfish There's a jellyfish out there that's basically cheating at life. When it gets old or stressed out, it just turns back into a baby. It's like having a video game character with infinite lives. This jellyfish is smaller than your pinky nail. It's got a bright red stomach that you can see through their clear body, like a tiny floating lava lamp that never burns out. When life gets tough, it pulls in its tentacles and basically melts itself down. All its adult cells transform into baby cells, and it starts life over from scratch, like taking apart a Lego creation and using the same pieces to build a brand new one. These time-traveling jellies started in the Mediterranean, but now they're everywhere. They've been hitchhiking on ships, floating around in the water tanks. These tiny immortals are taking free cruises across the globe. Being immortal doesn't help much when you're fish food. They still get eaten by predators or killed by pollution. But if they avoid becoming someone's lunch, they can keep resetting forever. Number 8. Sloths are secret swimming champions. These lazy tree huggers are actually amazing swimmers. On land, they move so slow that algae grows on their fur. But in water, they transform into speed demons. They can swim three times faster than they move on land. That's like finding out your grandma who takes forever to cross the street is secretly an Olympic sprinter. Their long arms that usually hang from branches become powerful paddles. Their fur traps air bubbles, turning them into furry submarines, and they can hold their breath for up to 40 minutes underwater. Their special neck bones let them rotate their heads almost all the way around. This helps them keep their nose above water while swimming like a furry periscope with arms. Mother sloths even carry their babies on their backs while swimming through flooded forests. The babies cling on like tiny backpacks while mom does all the work. That same sloth barely moving in the tree could probably beat you in a swimming race. Number 7. Dolphins have names. Every dolphin has its own unique whistle that works just like a name. They create this whistle when they're young and keep it for life. It's like having a personal ringtone that never changes. When dolphins get separated from their group, They'll call out using their whistle. Other dolphins recognize this whistle and know exactly who's calling. They can even copy each other's whistles, basically calling each other by name. A mother dolphin can pick out her baby's whistle from hundreds of others. She'll recognize it even when they're separated by large distances. Scientists tested this by playing fake versions of these whistles, and the dolphins still knew exactly who was who. These whistles work like a phone number that never changes. Dolphins use them to find their friends stay in touch with family, and keep track of who's who in their social circle. They're basically walking around with built-in name tags that they can broadcast through the water. Number 6. Octopuses have three hearts. Two hearts pump blood to the gills, and one pumps it to the rest of the body. Their blood is bright blue like someone spilled a slushy inside them. This happens because their blood uses copper to carry oxygen instead of iron like we do. When an octopus swims, its main heart actually stops beating. That's why octopuses prefer to crawl around instead of swimming. It's like trying to run a marathon with one of your hearts on lunch break. These three hearts work together to power their massive brain network. Each of their eight arms has its own mini brain that can think independently. So they're basically walking around with nine brains and three hearts. Number 5. Polar bears aren't white. Those big fluffy bears walking around the Arctic aren't actually white at all. Their fur is completely see-through, like tiny glass tubes. And under all that transparent fur, they've got jet black skin. The clear fur works like a bunch of tiny fiber optic cables. When sunlight hits these hollow hairs, it bounces around inside them like a laser show. All this bouncing light makes them look white, even though there's no white pigment anywhere. Their black skin isn't just for looks. It soaks up heat from the sun like a solar panel. The hollow hairs trap this heat close to their body, like wearing a coat made of tiny thermoses. These bears are walking around in what's basically a full-body thermal suit. Clear fur on the outside to look cool. Black skin underneath to stay warm. 
the perfect outfit for sneaking up on seals. Number 4. Wombats Poop Perfect Cubes These chunky Australian animals are walking around with built-in 3D printers in their guts. They're the only animals in the world that poop out perfect cubes. Not oval, not round, but actual geometric cubes with flat sides and sharp edges. Their intestines have special stretchy zones that squeeze and mold their poop into this weird shape. Some parts are tough and squeeze hard, while others are gentle and take their time. Like a Play-Doh factory, but way grosser. Wombats use their poop to mark their territory, stacking them on rocks and logs. Regular round poop would just roll away, but these stay put like tiny building blocks. A single wombat can drop about 100 of these cubes every day. Scientists studied this so much they won an award for figuring out how it works. They're even using what they learned to develop new ways to make materials. Number 3. Flamingos aren't born pink. Baby flamingos start life looking like sad gray ducklings. Their fabulous pink color comes from what they eat. These birds are basically walking mood rings that change color based on their diet. They get their color from tiny shrimp and algae loaded with special pigments. These are the same things that make carrots orange and leaves turn red in fall. Their bodies take these pigments and stuff them into their feathers like natural hair dye. The more shrimp they eat, the pinker they get. Some flamingos end up so pink they look like they fell into a vat of Pepto-Bismol. These birds feed by turning their heads upside down in the water. Their beaks work like built-in strainers, filtering out all the pink-making food, like having a permanent smoothie straw attached to their face. Zoo flamingos actually get special pink pills mixed into their food. Without these pills, they'd fade back to their original boring gray, like a printer running out of pink ink. Number 2. Hippos can't swim. These massive beasts spend most of their time in water, but they don't actually swim. Their bones are so dense that they sink like rocks. Instead of swimming, they push themselves off the bottom of rivers with their legs. They bounce and push along the riverbed like they're on the moon. These four-ton animals can move faster underwater than most humans can run on land. Their dense bodies are perfect for this lifestyle. They use their weight to stay anchored at the bottom, while other animals get swept away by currents. They've got special red oily sweat that keeps their skin from drying out, and they can hold their breath for up to five minutes while doing their underwater marathon. These chunky animals can push themselves through water at speeds of up to five miles per hour, and nobody wants to argue with an animal that can outrun you on land and underwater. Number 1. Koalas have human fingerprints. These sleepy tree huggers have fingerprints that look exactly like ours. Not just similar, but so identical that forensic experts can't tell them apart. Their prints have the same swirls, loops, and patterns that make human fingerprints unique. Scientists found this out in the 1990s while working at a wildlife park. The discovery caused problems for crime scene investigators. They had to start checking if any koalas lived near their crime scenes. The ridges help koalas grip tree branches and feel the texture of eucalyptus leaves, like having built-in tire treads on their fingers. This is strange because koalas split from our family tree over a hundred million years ago. They developed these prints completely on their own. Nature basically copied our fingerprints onto these fuzzy eucalyptus addicts. Their cousins like kangaroos don't have anything like this. Only koalas have these human-like prints. That's all for today. I'll be making similar videos in the future. Subscribe to see them.